so at the moment uh, Grey Zone Warfare is getting review bombed on Steam because of the performance issues and um, I actually don't blame people for giving it bad reviews but I do have a couple of settings here that I want to give to you that will definitely improve your um, overall performance in Grey Zone Warfare. So for our display settings we have VSync turned off, um, brightness, contrast, saturation and gamma is all up to yourself, self, it's personal preference. My frame rate limit is set to unlimited, my frame rate limit background is 30 fps. So to come down to the main ones here on quality we have global illumination set to low or shadow quality is also low, texture resolution is medium, effects quality low, reflection quality low and seeing as there's so much foliage in this game uh, we have it set to medium, post processing will be set to medium also, motion blur is turned off, you always want to turn off motion blur unless you're playing a single player game and you want that immersive feeling. So we're down in advance now and on to the main ones here, these are the ones that's going to help people out with the Nvidia graphics cards, especially people who are on um, 30 cards, 30 series cards or even 20 series cards. AI upscaling method will have to be set to DLSS. FSR right now has a problem where it keeps crashing but FSR does give you really good frame rates but it keeps crashing at the moment so DLSS is the only way right now so for our super resolution we have a set to DLAA our sharpness is on 50 and so my NVIDIA reflex low latency will be set to on plus boost and um, before I mess around with these settings I was averaging between like 40 and 50 max I was hitting like 70 but it was dropping like it was if I was ADS and with an ACOG it was dropping down to like 20 to 30 FPS but this is pretty solid what I have right now is pretty solid it's keeping me to 60 to like 90 FPS and there is one more set in here boys that has helped me out a lot so on your PC on the little search bar on the left you want to look up graphic settings and hardware accelerated GPU scheduling you want to turn that on now usually I always have this turned off but you want to have it turned on for this um, definitely will help your performance a small bit more make sure you upgrade to the latest drivers as well boys that also does help um, that's all for now i hope that these settings help out someone anyway 